haunts you when you're old and gray. There'll be some changes made today. Producer, our production manager, our uh, our boss, basically. Tonight. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're gonna give him the floor here to, to do a little public service announcement. All right. I hope you guys can hear me. Uh, I brought this mic up level, but uh, please put your hands together virtually for this amazing band tonight. We're very lucky to have them with us. Uh, like he said, my name is Colin Shook. I am a pianist here in town, and I've been running this Monks Jazz Series for about three and a half years. We've done uh, 95 or 94 public shows, sort of listening room concerts all over East Austin, and now we're trying this whole live streaming thing. And this is a space that I rented here on June 8th to sort of accommodate this uh, series with the Austin Jazz Society. They started Project Safety Net there at the end of March, and I think they raised up to $25,000 um, there by the first week of April and sent it out to all the musicians that applied for it in the form of $500 checks really supporting these guys before there was any 1099 or freelance, um, you know, self-employed um, support or information about those kinds of things. So uh, kudos to the Jazz Society. To date, we've done nine concerts. They've had some other donations, but also through our concerts, we've been able to raise $55,000, which has helped mm. over 69 musicians, at least one of the last four months since the pandemic hit. They've really been supporting the musicians, the jazz guys here in town, and it's really an amazing thing to be working with them. Um, tonight's a great concert. I definitely want to encourage you to donate to the, um, let's see, I'm trying to get into the list of the early sponsors we have this week, but it just doesn't seem to be working here. Um, yes, it's working now. Uh, if you donate $100 or more, you'll be recognized as an early sponsor, but you know, $5, $10, $20 goes a long way to pay this band, cover the venue fees, and you know anything left over will be going to this Project Safety Net. Thank you to the early sponsors that donated last week during the last show or before today. Uh, Teresa Coates, Art Klimpfner, Roth Judd, Anthony Patton, Mary Lou Russell, and of course, the Austin Jazz Society. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Please send this to your friends and family. Go on, go on over to YouTube if you wanna watch it and double the video and double the audio quality. Uh, Facebook here is fine, but um, any shares and, and all those things are greatly appreciated. And please comment and let us know how it's sounding. I'm over here mixing the band. So if you have any suggestions, I'm all ears. Uh, without further ado, um, what do you guys have next? We're gonna do a uh, Gershwin tune for you. This uh, with lyrics by Ballard McDonald and Buddy DeSilva. This is a tune called Somebody Loves You. Somebody loves me, I wonder who, I wonder who he can be. Somebody loves me, I wish I knew who he can be worries me. For every guy who passes by, I shout, hey, maybe you were meant to be my lover. Somebody loves me, I wonder who, well maybe it's you.
loves me I wonder who I wonder who he can be Oh, somebody loves me I wish I knew Who he can be Loves me For every guy who passes by I shout, hey, maybe Gershwin. We're going to uh, uh, continue now with a tune that, um, uh, let's see, this is a uh, Lester Young and Billie Holiday song from about 1937. And uh, this happens also to be uh, the title track on a CD that came out last month, um, a CD that came out last month by the Brooks Pruma Orchestra called This Year's Kisses. And uh, Alice and, and Ryan and myself are on this uh, CD. And uh, this is the title track. And uh, if you would like to uh, get a hold of that, um, that recording, it's at uh, Brooks Prumo Orchestra uh, dot bandcamp, uh, at bandcamp dot com. All right. Um, and these lyrics are, are quite, uh, quite fitting as a uh, sort of the theme of uh, 20. <laughs> this year's kisses. You take a pen.
fun. Yes, uh, boy, there's nothing quite like kissing a mask, huh? <laughs> um, we're glad you're all here tonight. If you do Carrie. <laughs> if you do Carrie. <laughs> Speaking of Carrie, this has actually belonged to Dick Carrie. Uh, of, yeah, of all, of all the people. Um, anyway, that was a little esoteric uh, in a trivia for you. Um, we're going to continue with a little instrumental. Um, this is a tune uh, because, well, first of all, we have to say happy birthday to Louis Armstrong. Um, he's our, he's a, a, a mentor and a hero and uh, an amazing artist, an amazing uh, entertainer, um, and, and pretty much a, a father of um, the, certainly of the jazz that we play, and uh, just a wonderful, wonderful and amazing human being. Um, so we're celebrating his uh, birthday today. He celebrated his birthday on July 4th, 1900. Uh, his, his birth certificate indicated he was born on August 4, 1901. So we're giving a, a nod to that as well. Um, this is a tune that uh, Lewis wrote uh, for, uh, or that uh, Lil Hardin, his wife, wrote, and, uh, and, and they recorded in 1927. This is a tune called Struttin' with Some Barbecue. We'll start with the verse and then we'll do the chorus. And then you'll take your chorus. One, two, one, mm, mm.
done that in a long time, folks. That felt really good to get that one out. I would like to uh, say... Uh, get up on that mic. Yeah. People can't really hear you out there. They're okay. Yeah. Oh, very good. Yeah. Right. Well, thank you. Let, let me say all that again. Hi, my name is David Jellema. This is the David Jellema Quartet. And we have uh, Ryan Gould on bass here. Yeah. 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 All the way from San Antonio, we have John Sheridan on the piano. And we're honored to have him here to drive up and, and be with us. Alice Spencer is our vocalist tonight, and we are, we are very grateful to have all of you here. Thank you so much for, um, uh, for being present tonight and, uh, and enjoying live music, as it were. And um, uh, let's, let's uh, slow things down a little bit and play a tune. Uh, I guess I have to breathe a little bit here. <laughs> we're going to do a, a tune. What's that? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, yeah, I just gotta. Well, this is a Jack Teagarden song, um, and it's about uh, communication style and getting to the point. And it's called Say It Simple. Why don't you do a little intro? <laughs> Say it simple so I can understand No fancy language, don't you talk too grand Don't get nervous or you'll begin to stammer Speak your piece and please forget your dicty grammar Say it simple just like a little child Don't let those adjectives spoil your style Tell me what you want and tell me just how And if that don't get it, then forget it right now I can understand Use all the easy words at your command Don't start lying I never cared for fiction Just Talk real clear Don't want no friction with your diction Say it simple Sweet mama, treat me right Don't want to hear a lot of talk tonight Don't forget about the bees and the birds And we'll soon have Speaking louder than words <laughs> Okay. Well, I sang for you. I, I guess I uh, worked up some nerve over the last few months. Thank you so much. Um, that was Say It Simple was a uh, tune that Jack Teagarden recorded. We're going to go uh, into something a little bit, uh, uh, a little bit more um, hmm, uh, erudite. There's a 1930, uh, 1938 Cole Porter tune that we're going to uh, perform for you. Um, this is a uh, this has a funny line in it uh, about having a boy up for some fine fin and hattie. It's a fish. Right, right. It's it's. I just said fine fin and hattie. <laughs> it's it's smoked it's smoked haddock 
and it's uh, was smoked with, with like green wood and uh, peat, and it's from the northern part of uh, northeastern part of Scotland. So that's what Finn and Hattie is. Right, and floundered on that one. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I'll work on it. All right. <laughs> My heart belongs to Daddy and his Finn and Hattie. All right. All right. Why don't we do bon ton dun Yeah, let's let's just go right on. All right. Bum and bum bum dun One, two. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> My fine fin and hatty. I just adore is asking for more, but my heart belongs to daddy. Yes, my heart belongs to daddy, so I simply couldn't be bad. Yes, my heart belongs to daddy. Da 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 da. So I want to earn you, laddie. Oh, I think you're perfectly swell, but my heart belongs to daddy, cause my daddy he treats it so well. Go. I might make a play for the caddy, but when I do, I don't follow through, cause my heart belongs to daddy. If I invite a boy some night to dine on my fine fin and hattie, I simply adore his back more, but my heart belongs to daddy. Yes, my heart belongs to daddy, so I simply couldn't be bad. Yes, my heart belongs to daddy. Da -da -da. Cause my daddy, he treats it so well. <laughs> yay, yay, thank you folks, thank you folks. I hear the applause, all I see is one eye there, one eye there, and one eye there. We've got all these disjointed <laughs> eyes in here that are kind of staring at us like, uh, like mono, mon monoculars. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> that their eye. That their eye. That their eye. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Um, 
Now, I'm, I'm going to make a, a, a let's see, uh, uh, this is a song that uh, Joe Derensburg, a clarinet player and, and sax player from uh, New Orleans, he wrote this tune. Uh, he played with Fate Marable and Jello Morton and, and Ringy Manone and Louis Armstrong. This is a tune, Louisiana IA, that uh, is featured on uh, our next album coming up. Um, Alice and I are uh, about to have a uh, CD released. Uh, through with uh, John Doyle and, and a bunch of other musicians from uh, the Austin area. And it's called the Oxblood Melodians. Um, and their, uh, uh, their release of it Friday includes this tune, and you can find that on Jonathan Doyle uh, Bandcamp page. Um, and uh, this is Louisie NIA. Let's see. All right, we're going to do the last 12 here. How does it go? <laughs> yeah, all right, here we go. One, two. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs>
That worked for me. I like Louisiana. Yeah, that's such a fun song to play. Oh, it's a fun song to sing. Uh, yeah, it's a fun song to sing. It's about beans. Yeah, <laughs> it's a song about beans. Excuse oh. me, excuse me. Um, <laughs> right, right. All right, um, I'm going to, uh, did you lose something? No, I do just something in the piano. I just didn't yeah, want it to put any strings at all. Did, didn't want it to, yeah, come back and haunt you. Um, I'm going to read everybody a, um, one of my, I, I don't know, it's just a favorite set of vocals uh, or lyrics of mine I, that I really like. And it's to the next tune that we're going to do. And the tune is called uh, Japanese Sandman. This was written in, oh gosh, 1920, I think. And um, it just has uh, very nice lyrics. I'll read those to you and then we're going to play it for you. And uh, here it is. Uh, the, the verse goes, won't you stretch imagination for the moment and come with me. Let us hasten to a nation lying over the western sea. Hide behind the cherry blossoms. Here's a sight that will please your eyes. There's a baby with a lady of Japan singing lullabies. Night winds breathe her sighs. Here's the Japanese sandman sneaking on with the dew. Just an old second-hand man. He'll buy your old day from you. He will take every sorrow of the day that is through, and he'll give you tomorrow just to start life anew. Then you'll be a bit older in the dawn when you wake, and you'll be a bit bolder with the new day you make. Here is the Japanese sandman. Trade him silver for gold. Just an old second-hand man trading new days for old. And uh, that's a... That's a tune I'd like to um, uh, I'd like to uh, dedicate to the transformations that we're all going to. <laughs> all right. Have a have a good day tomorrow. Mm -hmm. One, two. Japanese Sandman. And uh, 
That's a positive message for renewal and transformation through the blessings of sleep. <laughs> <laughs> now, we are going to move on. We are going to move on. Excuse me, I keep messing this. Uh, oh, it's all good. This, uh, Over here mixing. <laughs> <laughs> You're going like this all the time. Um, we're going we're gonna to feature uh, Ryan Gould, our bass player, and he's going to sing this uh, next number. Um, Avec le masque. Um, <laughs> this is a, a tune called. I hope this oh. works like this. I wasn't planning on a on a thing. Should we use your vocal mic or bring in mine or? It's it's uh. I think this will up, balance. What's up to you? If it's right there, will it work for you? It looks like it'll work. Okay, let me. Well, I mean, maybe we'll have it for you. Yeah, the my speaking mic. Yeah. We'll do it just like this. I'll make sure to tighten that. And I think that's just long enough. Yeah. Okay. And it's okay if you step on it. It's fine. <laughs> Stepping on it all night. And there should be... Well, <laughs> <laughs> that seems like it won't fall over. Well, if it does, it's comedy. And I'll just bring the bass down a little bit if you want to take a, a half a step forward and we'll be good. Just watch this cable right here. And yep. That should be better. All right. You want to go ahead and count it off, Brian. Where do you like it? Two. Eight out, right? Yeah. One. Yeah. No. Two. One, two, three.
that's Ryan J. Gould. Ryan is a um, is a uh, in very much demand here in Austin uh, as a bass player, and he's in about oh what 16 bands or so, I think. Um, he's on lots of recordings too. Um, check out Ryan J. Gould. I, I, I've had the pleasure to play with him for about uh, a little over 10 years now, and we've had a lot of musical collaborations. And uh, it's such a joy to, to have him on the, uh, on the stand with us. I like your bow tie, too. Hey, we, we, uh, we all have bow ties. Have, have you seen uh, John's, John's uh, very bright, bright purple? Oh, nice. Yeah, pretty, pretty, pretty uh, bow ties. Anyway, I thought uh, bow ties for the summer would be appropriate. And... Um, <laughs> We're going to uh, feature this man who's come all the way from San Antonio. He used to play with the Jim Cullum Jazz Band and has done a million things. I've known him through that uh, group, but also uh, he recorded on, on recordings that uh, I listened to as a kid of uh, my mentor, Tom Pletcher, who was into a, a really a, a big Bix uh, thing. And uh, John uh, recorded with, with a lot of people, and, um, and Tom was one of them. That's how I first got to, to hear him. It's been an honor to uh, get to know John uh, over the years, and so we're gonna we're gonna feature John uh, on a piano feature, a solo called "How Can You Face Me." By Thomas Patchwell. How can how can you face me with this thing on? <laughs> <laughs>
right. Uh, again, my name is Colin. I'm the organizer of the series. I've been the one, you know, mixing the sound. I uh, just got an a additional camera. We're trying some more three camera setups. I hope you guys are enjoying that. Um, put your hands together once again for David Jellema. Yeah. It's quite a pleasure to be doing this um, <laughs> here in the room. Good Hopefully, job, yeah, this is, a, I, this is a fun job I've cut out for myself. Um, it really sounds amazing here in the room. But um, I definitely want to say thank you to David Stoddard from the Austin uh, Traditional Jazz Society for sending this show out to their uh, audience. It's really awesome to have all you folks in. I see all the comments on Facebook and YouTube. It's awesome to widen our reach and bring in some more folks. So thank you guys so much for tuning in tonight. Also, thank you to the early sponsors, Teresa Coates, Art Klimpner, Ruth Judd, Anthony Padden, Mary Lou Russell and the Austin Jazz Society. Um, I have been notified that we've raised a little bit over $1,200 tonight. Thank you guys so much for your donations. Um, again, this is a fundraiser for the Project Safety Net. If you didn't hear my first spiel, uh, the Austin Jazz Society seeded $5,000 with this uh, new initiative called Project Safety Net. And, and by the first week of April sent out over $25,000 to different awesome musicians through an applica application as far as jazz musicians and their need and all, all those things. And to date, we've raised, I guess, about fifty-five dollars or $56,000 as, as of tonight. At least 54 of that has gone out to over 69 musicians in Austin to help support them through these crazy times. So thank you guys so much for donating to the Project Safety Net. Everything's tax deductible. You can go to the paypal.me slash Austin Jazz Society or go straight to austinjazzsociety.org. You can use your credit card there. If you really want to use Venmo, you can look me up, Colin-Shook, but I'll just pass that straight into the fund. There's no business Venmos or things like that, but uh, PayPal is definitely the best way to support what we're doing here, paying these guys tonight and support these musicians in town after we all, all, all get our thing. But um, thank you guys so much for tuning in. I'll hand it back over to you, David. Thank you, Colin. I um, I also want to just take a moment to uh, to thank uh, Tom Tom Van Tassel, uh, the president of the Austin Jazz Society, for inviting me to put together a quartet for this. I really appreciate that. Um, and and Colin, thank you for for doing our sound and doing our uh, our, our video. It, it it looks awesome from what I've seen. Um, thank you to the East Austin uh, Piano Shop for hosting this uh, these events. This is a great, uh, great space to, uh, to play in. Uh, it, it sounds good to me. Um, uh, Austin Traditional Jazz Society, too. Uh, we, wanna, we, we personally want to thank da uh, Dave Stoddard for making us aware of the, uh, the safety net and, and encouraging us to recommend other Austin musicians for the inclusion. Um, and again, thank you to John Sheridan for coming up from uh, San Antonio. Um, we are going to continue now with a uh, tune that uh, I myself wrote. And this is a song also that uh, my father wrote the lyrics for, and he also titled the song. Uh, it's called Shagtown Jubilee. And it's, it's actually about a nighttime street block party with, with uh, food and, uh, and singing and dancing and celebration in the streets. It's what we will all be doing when this whole thing is over. This is Shagtown Jubilee. And uh, I guess I have to take this mask off again. <laughs> Sorry, excuse me. There we go. Super glue don't work. <laughs> Super dude don't work. All right. Um, last eight. Oh, I think I'm going to do one of these. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, uh, I won't do that now. <laughs> All right. Uh, ten, ten. and tight skirts. They're wearing magic weaves and colors so wild you hardly ever see. They brought drums and pots and special cookery, stirring hot sauce. 
lessons for the Shagtown Jubilee. So kick off your shoes and shag away the blues, cause Jubilee is breaking out tonight. Shagtown Jubilee, Shagtown Jubilee, about a street party that we're all going to be in when this is over. Shagtown Jubilee. All right, um, we are going to, uh, sorry about that, I had a little uh, little glitch in my eyesight and I, I, I read the wrong, uh, wrong directive. Maybe I, need, maybe I need glasses. Yeah, anyway, we're going to do a, a tune called Sweet and Slow, um, and this is a this is a Fats Waller tune uh, about uh, an Aesop fable of the tortoise and the hare, and uh, John is going to John is going to sing this one on you. <laughs> I think I need a microphone, maybe. Oh yeah, let's uh, let's set him up with a mic. Do you okay. want um, do you want this one? This one will probably be the easiest one to reach. Yeah, we'll just move the whole stand and everything. Yeah, it's uh, it's uh. Uh, there we go. Well, oh. let's see. Let's do a little. Uh... <laughs> there we go. It's like, it's like changing underwear. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Thank you. We are, we are live. Live broadcast. Hi, folks. This is television, right? So that's right. <laughs> and we're going to put this right here for you, John. We're actually in a big old living room. Just kind of uh, uh, sitting around in our t-shirts. How's that for you? Eating, eating popcorn. <laughs> yeah. Fine. Right. You might okay. Notes at the top there, but... you That's all right. I can't go that high. I get a nosebleed. <laughs> <laughs> all right. What are we doing? Oh, yeah, sweet, sweet and, and slow. slow. And um, I'll play it with you. Okay. Uh, I'll play the, play the melody for you. And uh, you're going to join us on the bridge. It's just me and you, though, first.
sweet and slow. Mama, take it sweet and slow. While the band is moaning low. Mmm, honey, take your time. Sweet and slow We ain't got no place to go We ain't going to Buffalo No, no Honey, take your time You've heard of how The turtle and the rabbit ran a race You've heard of how the rabbit Ended up in second place Sweet and slow Rock up by me to and fro Oh honey, I know we can make it If we take it Sweet and slow of how the rabbit and the turtle ran a race <clears throat> you've heard of how the rabbit ended up in second place now honey let's don't be like the rabbit no 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 sweet and slow while the lights are burning low oh honey I know we can make Sweet but slow. Oh, slow down, baby. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, John. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for singing that Fats Waller tune. That's okay. So sweet and slow. You want to do that one again? What? <laughs> I mean, everybody liked it. I don't think it was that bad. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, um... We're uh, we're getting down to uh, we're, 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 we've got a few more minutes left. I think uh, I'd like. Do we have time for three more songs? Uh, I'd say yes. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Why don't Why don't we do "Friend with Pleasure"? Um, you have the you have your chords, your changes. Uh, Is that what this mic here? Yeah. Right on. I no you, uh, uh, John. You you know the tune, right? Yeah, I do. Just uh, we'll do it the way that uh, Tom's changes used to do it. Well, we, we took the changes from yeah. Mr. himself, by the way. Yes, yes, yes. Do you have, um, do you need your three of those? Uh, okay. okay. All right. Well, we're we're going to do it in F. You want to take a quick review of it? You want to do it in F? Okay. Oh, in F, yeah. Oh. 
Okay. We'll do it next. All right. I'm. I'm. Uh, I want to say a quick second. Uh, something about two mentors that I've I've had. Uh, Tom Pletcher and Jim Cullen both uh, passed away a year ago this month of August. And um, uh, Tom Tom made me aware of uh, Jim Cullum when I was a teenager. Uh, up in Montague, Michigan, I'd go over and visit him and, and talk with him about music. Uh, they had played together in Grand Rapids in, um, oh, around Bix's uh, birthday in 1978 and uh, developed a friendship and, and mutual admiration uh, uh, for years after that. Both of, them, uh, both of them were cornet players. John Sheridan has played with them both. Um, uh, and uh, they both also happen to, to play uh, Getson cornets, of, of which I am also a, a happy player. <laughs> so we're, we're going to do a tune um, that's dedicated to uh, those two guys, uh, and it's called I'll Be a Friend with Pleasure. You want to do uh, an intro, like four bars? Okay. Yeah, go ahead. Mm -hmm.
stuttering at the beginning there, but we uh, we got it all figured out and it sounded really nice. That was a that was a nice little rendition of "I'll Be a Friend with Pleasure," uh, one of the one of the last tunes that uh, Big Spiderbeck recorded uh, under his own name, the Big Spider Orchestra. We're gonna bring Alice back for uh, at least one more and maybe two more. We have uh, time for two more. We'll see how I um, do on this one. And yeah. if I pass the audition, I get another. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> You've passed. At least the audition did. Yeah, we're yeah. flying colors, no less. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, we're gonna do a tune um, that Bessie Smith uh, sung on Columbia in about 1923 with Clarence Williams. and. Uh, this is that happens to be another one that's coming out on the album on Friday, um, and it's called "Oh Daddy Blues." And this is one of Jim Cullen's favorites, by the way. Oh, okay. Right. Oh, good. All the time. Oh, oh okay. good. No. Uh, yeah. Right. John was saying that this is one of uh, Jim Cullen's favorites, also. Um. So. Okay. Yeah. Where's that start? Is that, uh, <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, brain is getting a little thick because it's just how it's just, it's just how it's just, you know. Getting tired of that, man. <laughs> <laughs> They're getting old. Hey. Anyway, oh, daddy. One. Calls to see me most every day, but it don't do me no good. Why? Because I'm lonesome for you. And if you care for me, then you will listen to my plea. Oh, Daddy, look what you're doing. Look what you're doing. Oh, Daddy, you with your fooling, think what you're losing. Oh, the little love I gave you is going to make you feel so awfully blue when you miss me and long to kiss me. You'll get the day that you ever quit of me. so lonesome just wait and see that there will be someone else making love to me and daddy daddy you won't have no mama at all
afford to tell you this now we've we've never played together as a unit before so the the, <laughs> the David Jellamo quartet has just been formed in existence at this moment before your very eyes without any testing done on anyone before this <laughs> okay we're gonna do one more tune for you it's been a real pleasure to play for everybody tonight and uh, we've, had, uh, we've had a wonderful and marvelous time here yes. in East Austin at the East uh, Austin Piano Shop with uh, Colin Shook here and uh, uh, Monk's Jazz Club and the uh, Austin Jazz Society and the Austin Traditional Jazz Society. We want to send our shout outs to all y'all. Thank you so much for uh, clicking and donating. Um, I, I, I have to say on behalf of uh, at least me and Ryan, we both have been beneficiaries of the, um, the, the project safety net. Um, we both have uh, uh, received it and, and it was, uh, you know, it works, it wor really does. So when you donate, um, it gets to musicians who are, who are actually in need of uh, assistance during a time when we can't play out. We're lucky to do this now. Finally, we're getting, uh, uh, we're figuring out what the uh, parameters are so that we can play together in some form or fashion. So thank you so much for being here tonight. And uh, thank you, John. Thank you, Ryan. Thank you, Alice. Thank you, Colin. Thank you, David. Thank you, David. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Hooray. Cheers, cheers. It's been a real pleasure. We're going to do a tune called Everybody Loves My Baby. And I, I think this is... Uh, this is a one uh, that Lewis recorded early on in his career, and perhaps it was a dream of his, of his mama's come true. <laughs> Everybody loves my baby. And we'll start with a uh, verse. Get me.
between the sea He's got those Zildjian movements Twenty years guaranteed There's no need for improvement As he begs built for speed And that's why everybody loves my baby But my baby don't love nobody but me No, nobody but me <laughs> <laughs> Thank you everyone Thank you, this is the David Jellema Quartet With uh, John Sheridan And Ryan Gould And Alice Spencer I am Jelly, they call me uh, David Jellema and thank you so much for being here tonight and for supporting live music during a pandemic. Welcome to the pandemic and have a good night and happy birthday, Louis Armstrong. Thank you. Thank you.